All right, so this is a magnetron for microwave, right? And today I'll be showing you how to test the magnetron for a microwave to know if it's good or bad. So this one is a good one, and this is a bad one, right? So for your test, this you need a multi-tester. It doesn't, it doesn't matter the brand, All right? So. And now it changed the, um, the knob to continuity. Very symbol across there. It looks like a Wi Fi symbol. Alright, so. Too much unclear. And then it touched the probe together. Right, so it work in right now to test this it'll give a continuity now we will test the good one first now it's also got continuity between these two terminals right so Right, so you get continuity right there. And that's supposed to get any continuity from one terminal to the body. Alright, so no continuity right there. And then switch it around. You put the other terminal across there. And then you touch the other part of the body, any part of the body. And then no continuity, right? So you know this working, this magnetron working. Now the bad one. Now we start to get continuity here, right? So you're getting continuity in the bad one. And from one terminal to the body, you're not supposed to get continuity. So if you get continuity, therefore it's bad. Alright? So let me test it and show you. See? You're getting a reading. Right, so I'll switch the terminals. You see, you get a reading. So therefore, this one bad. Right, so now we know how to test for continuity on a microwave magnetron. So let me test by this one again to make sure. Right, continuity in both terminals. None. On the body, all right. So, none on the body. So, this one good now. One of the reasons why these things are short is because filament there's a filament inside here, all right. There's a filament inside here, let's go bad. So, whenever this, whenever this go bad, the magnetron will spoil. Alright, so that is about it. As always, thanks for watching my videos. Don't forget to subscribe, share, like, leave a comment below. Until next time, Mr. Fixit360 saying good luck with your repairs.